Hi, this is Amy, and I'd like to show you what the new feature of quizzes in locked mode looks like from both the teacher's point of view and the student's point of view. So let's get started. I'm now looking at this Google Classroom as a teacher, and I'm going to click Create and Quiz Assignment. So you'll see that since I have locked mode on Chromebooks available in beta, I'm able to turn this switch on. So let me go ahead and set up my quiz and then we'll look at it as a student. All right, so you can see I have just created a short quiz here. It's got a couple of questions. I have added in some correct answers and um, I'm gonna make my questions required and then I'm going to log in as a student and take this quiz and we'll see what it looks like. So here it is from a teacher's perspective and now that I have um, put it into my assignment, hold on let me complete that process. So I've put it into my assignment that we'll see in Google Classroom. So here it is. I'm going to be able to assign it and then we'll take a look at what it looks like from the student's perspective. So here it is from the teacher's perspective. Let me take a look at it from the student's perspective. All right, well, this is not my normal mode of recording, but I can't use Screencastify because when I enter locked quiz mode, it's going to shut down access to any extensions or other web pages, which I just found out when I tried to do this. So take a look at this. I think you guys are going to be so excited to see it. So I'm looking at this course now as a student. I'm on the classwork page and I'm looking at the quiz that you just saw me create as a teacher. So now I'm gonna click the words next to the little preview there and I'm gonna start taking my quiz. So it tells me locked mode is on. Once you start, you can't open anything else. Make sure you save your other work before you turn it on. Um, and it tells me what email address I'm using. So when I'm ready to go, I can click start quiz. And now you can see I've got this window that I can't get out of. Let's say I thought, well, I'm just going to go Google this real quick and then come back. So I can go to close quiz, but I get the message. If you close this, your responses will not be submitted. Opening it again will notify the form owner. Okay, so I better not do that. So let me go ahead and answer my questions and submit. And now I'm taken back to my browser. I can see my other tabs as they were before. Um, if my teachers allowed me, I can view the scores and take a look at how I did. Um, and I can open up the assignment. So that is really exciting. I, I hope you guys are as excited about this as I am. It's something that teachers have been asking for for such a long time, and it's finally here, or almost here anyway. It's in beta mode. I will put the link to sign up for the beta in the description of this YouTube video in case you don't see this option yet. Uh, remember, students will only be able to see and use this on Chromebooks, so uh, another incentive to make sure you're using Chromebooks in your classroom. Hope that helps and have a great day. Bye-bye.